We are proud to present an overview of the Shigaya Renewable Energy Prediction System developed by NCAR, the U.S. National Center for Atmospheric Research, and sponsored by KISSER. Weather models are a foundational input to the prediction system. We use global models, which predict the weather over the entire planet at lower resolution. We also run a specialized regional model focused on a smaller area over Kuwait and run at higher resolution to better simulate details of the wind and cloud fields. Along with the predictions from global and regional weather models, we take wind and solar observations from Shigaya and feed all of that into a machine learning algorithm developed by NCAR, which produces a tuned consensus prediction of wind speed, solar irradiance, and most importantly, power. To demonstrate the solar forecast, we show solar irradiance predictions from the regional model on the left and the machine learning prediction on the right. As we move through the day, the lighter areas indicate that the model predicted some thin clouds over Shigaya during the middle of the day and thicker clouds further to the south. Our prediction system display for solar includes two panels, power on the top and irradiance on the bottom. The dashed green line is the prediction and the solid black line is the observations for this day. The two shades of yellow indicate expected ranges of variability. This interactive display allows the operator to zoom in to specific times of the day to see the predictions in more detail. The operator can also turn certain lines on or off according to their preference. On this day, some scattered clouds caused the observed irradiance and power at Shigaya to exhibit some variability. Our forecast was in the middle of this variability, and the yellow bars show that our system predicted this variability well. Moving on to wind, the regional model captures a lot of fine detail of the wind field. Throughout this 24-hour period, the wind direction changed several times, from northerly winds to westerly winds, and then a sudden switch to easterly winds. Modeling these details is essential for good predictions of wind power. We have the same prediction system display for wind power on top and wind speed on the bottom. As you can see, on this day our prediction, the dashed green line, was close to the observations, the solid black line, throughout the day. The wind speed was high enough that the wind turbines produced maximum power for much of the day. Combining these into a total power display, where we add the predicted wind and solar power at Shigaya, we see that on this particular day, not only was our predicted total power close to the observed total power through all 24 hours, but Shigaya was operating at near maximum capacity, both during the daytime when both wind and solar power were available, and at night when only wind power was available. Over the coming months and years, the NCAR Kizer team looks forward to continually developing and improving the Shigaya Renewable Energy Prediction System as Shigaya continues to grow and power Kuwait's future.